Today I'm going to demonstrate an experiment in physics using an instrument called micrometer screw gauge. The objective of the experiment is to measure the diameter and hence the volume and density of a spherical bob using micrometer screw gauge. The apparatus required for conducting the experiments are micrometer screw gauge, spherical bob and a digital balance. Parts of screw gauge include anvil, spindle, U-frame, mean scale, circular scale, thimble, and a ratchet. Micrometer screw gauge works on the principle of screw which states that the rotation of circular scale is directly proportional to the linear distance moved by its circular scale. Pitch is the linear distance traveled by the screw in one complete rotation of the circular scale. Least count or LC is the smallest value that a micrometer screw gauge can measure accurately. Least count is calculated by pitch divided by total number of circular scale divisions. For a spherical bob, the density of spherical bob is calculated by mass by volume, which is mass by pi by 6 into d cube, where d is the diameter of the bob. In mean scale, the value of 10 mean scale divisions is 10 mm. Similarly, the value of 1 mean scale division is 1 mm. In circular scale, number of division in circular scale is 100. Pitch of the screw is linear distance traveled by the screw in one complete rotation, which is 1 mm. So the least count is pitch by total number of circular scale divisions, which is 1 by 100, and therefore 0 0.01. Non-zero error is when the zero of circular scale coincides with zero of main scale. Positive zero error is when the zero of circular scale lies just below the reference line. Negative zero error is when the zero of circular scale lies just above the reference line. In the given screw gauge, the zero of circular scale lies above the reference line of main scale. So we have negative zero error. The reading is calculated to be 70. So the negative zero error is calculated by minus 100 minus coinciding circular division with baseline multiplied with LC. In the given experiment, it is 0 0.3 mm. First, place the spherical bob in between anvil and spindle perfectly. Then note the mean scale and circular scale reading. Repeat this process four times by rotating the bob in different direction. Then the mean of four observations should be calculated. Then the mass of sphere is measured in digital balance and it comes out to be 26.38 gram. For diameter of spherical bob, the mean scale reading is taken to be 19 mm, circular reading is 30, Value of CSD is 0 0.3 and total is 19.3. For observation 2, mean scale is 19, circular reading is 26, value of CSD reading is 0 0.26 and total is 19.26. For observation 3, mean scale reading is 19, circular reading is 25, value of CSD reading is 0 0.25 and total is 19.25. For observation 4, mean scale is 19, circular reading is 24, value of CST reading is 0 0.24 and total is 19.24. The mean diameter is 19.26 mm and the corrected mean diameter is mean diameter plus the negative zero error which is 19.56 mm. After the calculation, mean diameter is 19.26 mm or 1.93 cm. The mass of spherical bob by balance is 26.38 gram. The density of spherical bob is mass by volume, which is 7.12 gram per centimeter cube. It is found experimentally that the spherical bob has diameter 1.93 cm and density 7.12 gram per centimeter cube. The diameter of a spherical bob is determined by using a micrometer screw gauge and its density is calculated. 